Hey guys and welcome to the mesh creation tutorial for Blender. In this video we're going to go over how to create a mesh in the viewport. It's similar to adding objects but a little bit more specific and we'll go into the differences between a mesh and an object as well as the differences between a mesh and a surface for example because they do look very similar. So let's go ahead and get started. Uh, first of all the definition of a mesh is an object made up of polygons. So if we were to look at this cube here this cube is indeed a mesh because it has polygons here. We can go into edit mode by hitting tab and I'll go over edit mode in the next video. But ultimately in edit mode you can see the individual vertices and the individual faces. That is a polygonal mesh where A OK. Now I can also press shift A to go to the add menu and you'll notice all these different subsections of objects we can add along with mesh curve, surface, metaball, those are the four main ones. For modeling, you're going to want to have polygons. That's very, very important. Most of the time, people model with meshes, not with curves or surfaces. So you want to go into this mesh subsection here, and you can choose any one of these. These are all meshes. These are all made up of polygons. I'm going to go ahead and choose the UV sphere so I can compare what the UV sphere looks like, which is a mesh, a polygonal mesh and compare it with the surface NURBS sphere. Now, these two things look very similar. As you can see, I'm going to go ahead and drag that out. This is the NURBS sphere, which is a surface, and this is the UV sphere, which is a polygonal mesh. I'm going to go ahead and actually smooth the UV sphere as well, because you can do that. I can just select the UV sphere here, go to the T tab, and hit Smooth under Shading. And you'll notice they actually look very similar now. So how do you tell these apart? Well, again, you can go into edit mode by hitting tab. And you'll notice that this has a bunch of polygons and vertices. And it corresponds to the shape of the object. That means that this is made up of polygons. What you see is what you get. However, with surfaces, surfaces are by definition a mathematical representation of a shape. So in this case, the sphere it's not made up of polygons, but rather mathematical equations and formulas that form this perfect sphere and doesn't give you a lot of room to edit. So I'm going to go ahead and hit tab with this object selected, which is the NURBS sphere, and you'll notice it looks very different. So this is not what you want. This does not allow for very much editing. It has very, very limited controls, but can be useful in some situations. However, if you're modeling, you don't want to use surfaces, you want to use meshes, like so. So that's mesh creation in Blender. 